Welcome back. This week's Appalachian Grown takes us to Man Cave Distilleries, a distillery deep in Lewis County. Jake Ostro stopped by and has more. I would love to make West Virginia the, the moonshine capital of the world. Man Cave Distillers may have opened its doors in 2018, but its history begins well before that. The distillery uses fresh West Virginia water from these hand dug mines from over 70 years ago to create whiskey, vodka, gin, and moonshine, an alcohol perfected here in the Mountain State. West Virginia has been making moonshine since, moon, since God, since West Virginia has been here. West Virginia has always been known for its moonshine, but now it's got the hardware to back it up. It's a double gold at the uh, San Francisco World Spirits Competition, which is the Oscars of the spirits industry. Specifically, the double gold came from Man Cave's latest and most popular product, the cinnamon moonshine. We had literally just finished the product a couple days before I shipped it. Um, and I was not expecting a double gold on that one. I wasn't, wasn't really expecting anything from that one. Not only did the cinnamon moonshine win top prize, every other product in Man Cave's arsenal won at least some award in the competition. Despite the accolades, the pandemic has hurt the distiller and has caused lots of logistical issues. We've been trying to get bottles for almost a year now. Uh, we have been unable to do so. I don't know when I'm going to see another bottle. Uh, I may have to be figuring out some other solution or, God forbid, shut down. When the bottles do come, man is eager to showcase the newest addition to the lineup, a rum that is ready to go when it can. From Man Cave Distillers in Lewis County for 12 News, I'm Jake Ostro.